important to the advantages of enterprise resource management. Improves accuracy and productivity. Integrating and automating business processes eliminates excess effort, and improves accuracy and productivity. Departments with interconnected processes can synchronize work to achieve faster and better outcomes. Improves reporting. Some businesses benefit from enhanced real-time data reporting from a single source system. Correct and complete reporting help companies adequately plan, budget, forecast, and communicate the state of operations to the stakeholders. Improved efficiency. ERP allow businesses to quickly access needed information for clients, vendors, and business partners. With improved planning, the ERP system delivers a huge increase in the efficiency of day-to-day -day and routine transactions, such as order completion, on-time shipment, seller performance, quality management, invoice reconciliation, sales completion, etc. Cross-department collaboration. The more divisions your enterprise has, the more critical it is to manage internal communication techniques to avoid errors. And if your enterprise has branches all over the world, you must need a strategy for everyone to stay in touch across time zones and language barriers. With ERP communication tools, you can manage scanned documents, files, emails, texts, and phone call recordings. Data security. Your company deals with a lot of sensitive data. An ERP system provides security by keeping all your important and secret documents and communications in one place. Cloud ERP use cutting-edge security protocols to assure your company doesn't fall victim to harmful attacks. Disadvantages of Enterprise Resource Planning Complexity and Risks of Failure Sometimes, ERP projects are not successful because business processes and data requirements are found to be too complex during the requirements gathering method, and employees are forced to take part in change management. Because of a long deployment method, the ERP system might not keep speed with modifications that the business needs to make in a dynamic environment of intense competition. Costly and infrastructure needed. Setting up an on-premise ERP system requires a huge investment in hardware, software, and its teams. Traditional on-premise and hybrid ERP requires on-site servers and networking infrastructure in the data center of the company. Not only that, servers must be powerful enough to handle huge amounts of data. Companies also need a strong and effective security system to protect every data. Long deployment period. The process of deployment of any ERP system requires a long period of time, as it involves many functions, departments, and changes. Employees also take time to get comfortable with this system. If you want to read in details or download the PDF, go through the link in the description. Like the video, it will motivate me to make more videos for you, and don't forget to subscribe to Education Leaves.